I've mentioned William Bailey, the painter, decorator and amateur photographer of the late 1800s, early 1900s in Cookham. Well, this is a late 1800s selfie. <laughs> well, not quite a selfie, because you uh, had to have somebody remove the lens cap of the camera and uh, count and then replace it. You can see uh, a very good photograph, except for the youngest member of the family, the little girl. Uh, she moved her head and uh, the uh, features of her face sort of went blurred white with, uh, with the hat. So uh, that is it. It was taken at the Fleet Bridge as it was prior to the bridge that uh, you have now. It's of uh, iron construction as you can see. Uh, but very narrow. A matter of fact, uh, with uh, people pushing a pram, for instance, uh, two prams could not pass one another. They would have to sort of wait until one coming over uh, let you get by and, uh, and so on. Same with bicycles, I should imagine, if uh, somebody rode there. The uh, Picture is winter time. There's a slight smattering of snow on the ground. Everybody's well wrapped up. And also, uh, you can see that the moor is flooded. So, uh, it's uh, one of the uh, many Cookham floods. Even in those days, uh, they had them. So, but there you are. That's uh, Mr. William Bailey and Mrs. Bailey and the three uh, daughters. The eldest one, uh, the tall one in the, in the middle of the group there, um, I've got a picture of her driving her father's uh, donkey cart, the one he used to take his uh, painting materials, decorating and so forth, from job to job. So, anyway, hope you like it. But it is, gives you an idea of the Fleet Bridge it was before the kindness of Mrs. Belfer Allen in memory of her husband had the brick one built. So bye for now. I hope you enjoyed it.